Okay, we're gonna continue on the duck boat build. Um, all that we really have left is the blind. Uh, of course, I gotta put some lights on it and mess with that trailer, but blind, the blind is today. Um, we're gonna go with something simple, like a, like a scissor blind. I just don't know if I want it to sit on the rail or set on the inside of the boat. I think I'll figure it out as I go. Um, nevertheless, it's gonna be simple. So let's get to it. Okay, here's my thinking. We got half inch conduit, three quarter inch, 90 degree angles. We're gonna cut this down to make the pivot points. And we're just gonna shove the half inch into the three quarter 90s. We're gonna put, drill two holes and drop two uh, nuts and bolts in there. And I think that would be pretty sturdy. On the pivot points, you know, we'll just put a locking washer, oh, it's a couple washers and a locking nut on there. And I think that will hold up pretty good. Okay, here's the idea behind these. Um, you know, I rounded the edges on them so it don't cut you or anything when they're in there. But anyhow, uh, mount these here, there, there, and there. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to make the blind eight foot with um, one foot overhang on each side. That's the plan. Alright, here you go. I'll kind of give you an idea what we're doing. This is just kind of mocked in there. I'm going to have to shorten them. But, um, of course, two, two bolts will go in here to hold this in there. It'll probably be a little bit shorter. Um, but it's just the, you know, it's just the scissor blind. Pretty common. Okay, there we go. I took a little bit of adjusting, but um, that's how I want it to sit. Rest on the rails. Everything's in place. I got, you know, two washers on both sides with a lock nut. The only thing I got to do now is put the two screws in each corner so it doesn't move or flex or anything. I want it to be rock solid. In my experience, I've used those couplers before and they just break. They don't work out. So I'm screwing those two in. See that? That's how you want to do it. Don't use those couplers. This right here is going nowhere. It ain't gonna flex. Nothing. No play. You can see how it that three-quarter inch elbow is squashed right on this half inch. That's how you want to do it. Okay, framework is done. This is it. She's pretty rock solid. I could make different holes to adjust this but this is pretty much the way it looks now is how I like my blinds to be a little higher on the back of me lower right here in the front that's of course if you're backed up against something it is rock solid doing this method here it's not gonna fail
All right. Let's uh Let's put the blind on. Blind material on. Okay, here we are. This is done for the most part. I might have to do a little bit of trimming down here. Bring it up a little bit. I don't want it sitting floating in the water too much. But um, all that's really left is I have to paint paint the um, conduit. They had nothing at Home Depot. So, paint the conduit. Now, this is going to have, of course, the two, the two pieces of the blind that just come up and scissor, and I put the pins in, and then there'll be three pieces extra. This one that covers the motor, this one that covers the back of the boat, and this one that covers the front. And those will be rolled up so let's uh drop the let's drop the blind right now and see what we got Okay, looks good. Pretty happy with it. Blind is done. Next step, and the last, uh, I gotta mount the headlight. Mount this seat. I'm gonna want that to be a swivel seat right there. So I want it to be mounted on a swivel course paint this conduit put my registration stickers on fix that head tail light back there move this stuff up forward build a little uh, bumper for it and that is it We should be in the water. See that that extra stuff just rolls up and sits right back here. When I 
when I drive I'll just drop this seat down and either stand up right here or just sort of sit right here putter my ass out there I think it should be just fine Okay, that's going to be it for the boat blind. I'll see you guys on the next one.